needed to be able to get my car in so I could park. So I needed a bench that could fold from the wall. So I've got my bottle opener here, bench brush, some electricity, storage on the top. Got a latch and a lock in the middle there and the hinges. On the right side here I installed the power strip and it uh, works pretty nice. So uh, you'll notice there's no braces. I just fold it out and set it on top of the sawhorse here. It works out pretty good. I say I'll go ahead and show what that looks like. Okay, now I got the door open here, the workbench. Sawhorse holds in place. It's a good three quarter inch uh, plywood here with a quarter inch of hardwood on top. Thing's pretty solid. Got all my tools right here. Lock here works fine. Just put up the bench, toss on the lock, and I can pull my car in now. Uh, up here I nail in some two by fours to make a track. The reason I've got this L shape here is to take into account the workbench opening up. So if I were to take this one and go straight across, it would cut right into the workbench and I wouldn't be able to use it. So made a little L shape. Uh, and then I have these tarps. This one here is hung by a pulley. And this one over here is on a hinged arm. And so when you move the hinge over, it latches into the center there. And when you unlatch the pulley, that L shape folded tarp drops into place. You're good to go. So I'll show how that works next. Lift this up like so, bring it out, and just watch that light, of course. Latch it up over there. And what's interesting is that's half the job. This side here is really a piece of cake. We just got a G-clip up there holding a, a three-quarter inch dowel rod that's been bolted into the tarp. Uh, that clip comes up through some, uh, some slots there that the rope comes down, comes down below and then ends up latching here. So to go ahead and drop that down, we just take this up, and this drops down like so. Unlatch that, and it falls into place. So now I've got my L shape done. Uh, I've got everything else over here done, and it works out pretty slick. I've now got room also to have my bench come down and uh, turn on a heater or something and get this place warmed up. So keeps it nice and toasty and I fold it in half like so. And then I grab the bottom half and I flip it up so that I can hold it like this. And then uh, that's where this clip goes onto there. Let me go ahead and latch that quick and I'll be back. All right, so I got that latch. I needed that free hand to do that. So it can hang there now, that's no problem. I just come over here. It won't fall because that's stuck there in the clip. So I just come in like so and grab this, start pulling it and that brings it up to the top. And then I come up under here, latch it back in like I did before. The tarp's all good to go. And then to get the other piece back, it's just the reverse. Come in here, bring that over, there we go, and I'm ready to bring my car in the garage, works out pretty slick.